One thing that gives me optimism about the future of the SDGs is when major regional development banks like the ADB take them very, very seriously. If the financing institutions don't put them at the heart and centre of their programming and planning and partnerships with countries, we can't get anywhere because SDGs require political commitment and they require money to go with it. And you are such an essential part of, of that partnership. Companies in Asia that understand their overall impact on the environment and society, and they properly align their business and operations with the sustainable transition, they'll have the potential to become market leaders. And those that fail to adapt will likely be facing into more pressure from regulators and things like operational issues and reputational re repercussions of total inaction. That's exactly what I hear from the market is, you know, we need blended finance. We need to be able to de-risk some of these early, early stage investments. We need to be investing in innovation. We need to be investing in scaling some of the uh, enterprises in the areas that have the greatest amount of need. The SDGs are firmly embedded in our long-term corporate service strategy 2030. Our corporate targets on gender, climate change, and private sector mobilization are all strongly aligned with the SDGs. ADB's integrated and country-focused approach, combining finance, knowledge, and partnership, uniquely positions us to support our DMCs in their efforts uh, to achieve the SDGs. Yet, there is much more to be done and much to learn from our ongoing efforts.